Hello and welcome to another tutorial brought to you by ConciseTutorials.com. This is our pre-algebra series and in this lesson three we continue our exploration of whole numbers and specifically talk about set notation. So let's get started. In non-technical terms a set is a collection or group of things that share a common characteristic. So for instance you probably heard of a drum set. Well a drum set you know has a basic drum set at least has a bass drum and a tom drum and a snare drum and a cymbal and then you also have a throne or a seed, a bass pedal and some drumsticks. So here's a very basic drum set. Now in math when we're talking about sets we use a special symbols to show that this group of things go together and those are brackets. Brackets are the math symbols that we use for sets. So if we wanted to talk about a drum set in math notation within the brackets we would put the elements of this set of things. So a drum set would be within brackets the bass drum, tom drum, snare drum, cymbal, throne, bass, pedal, and drumsticks. But in math we're usually talking about numbers and so Let's look at an example of numbers that make up a set. If we go back to our first tutorial for our pre-algebra series, we talked about digits. And so here we show the digits in brackets to say this set of, of, of objects, the 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, they're a set because they're put into these brackets, and they're a set that we call digits. So this is set notation for the digits. We could also look at the set of whole numbers. The set of whole numbers, as we've shown before, is the set of numbers 0 through 9, and then all of the numbers that can be created um, using those digits. And actually, we're going to talk a little bit more about this in the next tutorial when we formally define what whole numbers are. But for now, let's just look at another, another example of something written in set notation. And again, here we see that we have all these numbers and that they're in the brackets and we have 0 through 9 and then our dot 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 means that the numbers just keep going and going and going. And this would be called an infinite set. The set has no end. There's an infinite number of items in it. So again, the most important thing to understand about set notation is that the brackets are the notation that we use to show that something's a set. So like our drum set, we have a certain number of elements that make up a basic drum set. So this is the set notation for a drum set. The elements that make up a set notation for the digits, uh, we looked at those. Or the elements of the items that make up the set of the whole numbers. Um, but again, the key is that whenever you see the brackets, that means that these are a set of items that have a shared characteristic or whenever you have an items that share a characteristic and you want to say this is a set you always use the bracket notation so that was our tutorial on set notation coming up next in lesson four we will talk about the whole numbers and give it more of a formal definition definition to what whole numbers are so thank you for watching this tutorial provided by concisetutorials.com and if you're watching this video from YouTube then please take time to subscribe to our channel thank you